boom. What do you think? What do you think about that, Kenny? I, I everything that possibly, everything you could possibly think about is what I'm thinking about. Well, I'll tell you if you want to know what I'm thinking about right now. I'm thinking about that March 30th. Beetlejuice, 1988. Boom! He's got it. He's got it. <laughs> uh, what would we do without Beetlejuice? Did you see Beetlejuice in the theater? Uh, no, I did not. Did you? You didn't. Okay, I did. What? Yeah. Yeah, what? I saw Beetlejuice in the theater back in the day. Wow, yeah. wow, good yep. job. All yep. right. I helped. So when you look at like the box office yeah. for that, um, mm-hmm. you know, you probably can attribute like twelve to twenty dollars or whatever like that for my family and, and myself going. So you just, you know, be like, hey, if they didn't go, that number would be different. All right. If well, you know what? I'm glad to so hear I it. contributed to the old box office hall of Beetlejuice. Good Come job. On. All right. On with, Michael on, Keaton. on with it. That's a that's a that's a jam and a half, is it not? It's good the stuff. Best. It's good stuff. All right, Kenny, we're here. We're doing a show. Um, mm-hmm. we, wow, whoops, we got a thing going on. All right. Uh, yeah, obviously we are not in the same room. So if you if you see any little hiccups in things happen, it's because we're not in the same room, and that's fine. Yes. The, the, we, are, um, we are practicing uh, self isolation. So <laughs> sure, that's what we right? want to call it. Yeah. Um, all right. For the greater good. That's this is this is true, uh, and you're on your phone thing, right? For the internets. Yeah. All right. Yes, sir. <clears throat> I will uh, double check. Yeah. Okay. You see, this is all part of it. We're leaving it on there. We got some artifacting. Hey, listen, it's it's hey, it's, it's over Skype. It'll be fine as long as you can see his beautiful mug. It doesn't really matter, does it? All right, there we go. Here's the thing. This is a yeah. show where normally one of us comes up with a little scenario and the other one of us, you know, fills in the the, 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 the details and we do something silly and wacky. Um, this week, we're going to play a little trivia, Kenny. We're doing a little trivia. Oh, you're bringing, you're we're bringing ju- the trivia to we're me. We're just going to go trivia. Right. Yeah, we're all not right. going to. But listen, we're just going to. It's all verbal. There's no mm. images, no nothing. All right. You got fine. a lot of questions. Here. Oh, I asked, oh, really? All right. I asked Kenny to give me. Um, a bunch uh, of properties that he enjoys that mm-hmm. I said that he, and I said make them things that you know right yep 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 uh, and uh, what did you pick I picked uh, the Goonies yep Friday the 13th yep Super Mario Brothers yep um, Transformers probably yep one more I don't remember the last one Karate Kid that's it Karate Kid yeah okay so Kenny you are gonna we are gonna find out if you even <laughs> 80s bro alright and test your knowledge of all of these wonderful, wonderful uh, all right. uh, things here. Uh, How many questions? Well, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna lie. There are a lot. Okay, uh, a lot. Okay, so there's you said a lot lot. of questions. Okay? All right, so you don't know the number. Okay. Yeah, no. Uh, there's about there's <clears throat> about fifty questions. Oh wow. Okay. Awesome. Well, and then there's some bonus questions. Okay. So is is there a prize at the end? Do I get a prize? Well, I mean, you can pick one of the prizes that you have back there, or we can d- 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 deal with that. The thing is, I want to. I want to. I f- want to win. Keith Kurt. No, you know what? <laughs> no. Ah, oh, come on. I would like to win this picture of. Of. All right. The if Tanner. You, but, but but here's the thing: you only win it. Okay, you only win it if you get in the eighties. We're gonna do the same thing. I like. Oh, we're ca- gonna do the same thing. Okay, yeah, I like. I, but listen, but listen. Yeah. <laughs> a little caveat to that is, I um, yeah. There's about there's like it's it depends. It's about fifty questions. It's forty nine questions. Let's be truth be told. But because I had the bonus, it, look, it, it'll work out. It'll all be right, fine. Let's just yeah. Let's just we're get gonna to get, it. get into it. I'll figure it all out later. All right. Here's the deal. Let's start out. We're gonna start with uh, Friday the Thirteenth. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. So. Mr. Uh, Voorhees, let's go. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, so here we go. For number one, no, question number one, Friday the 13th section of this quiz. Are they multiple choice questions? All multiple or? choice, friend. Don't oh, worry they are. It. It's all multiple choice, yeah. Oh, dude, 100%. They're getting 100%. I know. Here. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, right. let's go. Let's here go. we go. Number one, Kenneth. Yep. Which of these films features the character Tommy Jarvis? Is it A, Friday the 13th, part one, part two, part three? Is it B, Jason X? Or ten, I guess it's X. Mm-mm. Freddy vs. Jason or Friday the Thirteenth, two thousand nine. Nope. That was B. Is it C? Part seven, part eight, and Jason goes to hell. 
Nope. Or is it D? D. Four, five, and six. <laughs> it's D because it wasn't the others. Yep, it's four, five, and All six. Right. Okay. All right. Played by three different actors. That's true. That's true. Yep. Corey Feldman um, and uh, Tom Matthews and whoever the second one was, or the third one was, rather. Yeah. No, hold no, on. second one. Hold on. I'm, you know what I have to do? Have Part to, five. All right, hold on. I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to, <clears throat> I'm going to have to mark something. Some, some yeah, stuff. you're going to have to, because, because guess what? I just got, I just got 100% correct. So. Well, I'm going to tell you right now. There, uh, yeah, you just, yeah, all right, hold on. And if you can, since I was so confused on that, just say A, what the thing is, B, what the thing is, because you're like, I did. blah, 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 that was B, and then I'm like, I Well, no, that was only, it was after the fact I said that. All right, um, all right, I got to write this all down, because I'm going to tell you why. You can't see what's happening, but people yeah. who are watching can see. Um, oh, that's right. Okay, I yeah. like that. No, 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 I, no. I'm not saying I have the questions on the thing. What I'm saying is no, no, every no, time I... No, 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 I know, but I, yeah, I got you. I got every you. time I move, I get out of the window where all my questions are, yeah. it shows my desktop background for some reason i don't know why it turns off skype whatever okay. doesn't right. matter so i have right. to i have to now mark hey, it man. down it's a necessary uh you yeah. know i'm gonna i'm gonna Set i'm gonna it. i'm gonna mark down i'm gonna mark these down all right all right question all right, two question yep, two. two two uh who is jason's first kill in friday the 13th part two is it a crazy ralph b nope. marcy nope. c annie or d alice alice well, you yeah. think it's Alice? Yeah. Okay. Do you want to know the answers as I go you... through? Yeah. All right. So you want to know I, yeah. instead of me? Instead of me. Uh... All right. So then yeah. I'm just gonna mark up. All right. So in that case, yeah, I'll I'm, just I'm get them right. I want to know because I want I want the. Um... All right. We'll do it a little I different want, than I, you did I, than you did last yeah, week. Yeah, I, I want right. the adrenaline right. and I want the. Um, you want the, the satisfaction of what positivity you got. and Alice. I want the okay. the the, uh, the you know what? not the inertia but you know what I mean like the I got you. You know what I do. I'm gonna get, I have little tidbits Please. about these two. So Alice survived the first film. She did, and yeah. But they she kinda, got it in the second yeah. film when she opens up. Here's a little bonus thing. It's not for points, but can you tell me what was in the fridge when she opened it up? Yeah, the head. Whose head? head? Um, probably um, probably Jason's mom's head. Correct, yeah. All right. Yeah. Cool. All right, here we go. So you got two right, bud. There you yep, go. Yep. Number three, in Friday the 13th, part five, Yep. who is the copycat? killer of jason is it a rob dyer b roy. tommy jarvis c roy burns or roy. d reggie roy burns roy. it is roy burns you are <laughs> correct well done yeah he acts as a copycat killed to avenge the death of his son joey who was killed by vic remember the the patient at the, the fat kid with the candy bar yeah right 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 do you know how he killed him uh yeah with an axe damn he's good He's good. So we started out with the easy ones. I know. I know. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. I know I know. I, uh, yeah. No. I hate me. I, I'm. I'm just. I don't care if they're easy or not. I love talking about this stuff. I just meant. I, I, I just meant Friday Thirteenth. You just know it really well. I, lo I love so, it, yeah. and I haven't seen them in years. Okay. Years. So here we go. So here Keep we go. On. Number Loving four. Yep. Um, in which Friday the Thirteenth film does Jason wear a burlap sack over his head instead of his trademark hockey mask? Two. Is it A Part Two? Is it B the a. first one? Is it C the third one? Or is it D the final chapter? A. It oh, sorry. Is yeah, a. a part two. Yeah, correct. Yeah, man, you're gonna. Yeah, you, you're gonna. You're gonna. I, once you said that, I was like, yeah. once you told me, like I saw that you wanted Friday Thirteenth, I'm like, yeah, he's just gonna. Yeah, 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 yeah. This stuff. Um, is, yeah. Yeah. Part two is the only where he doesn't. But the wear funny the thing is, did you know any of this stuff? Um, I, you know, I knew probably half of what you knew, but don't forget, yeah, we did yeah. this. We do a show called Classic Blend. Yep. Where we deep dot, we basically it's almost like we do a lot of research on these things. Yeah, and yeah. Remember that whole episode? You like killed it. You were like, <clears throat> well, you knew a lot of this stuff anyway. I knew like <laughs> half of this stuff. Yeah. Um, it's fun. But yeah, I part because part one was his mom. Part two was him with the burlap sack, yeah, and then yeah. yeah and then part up. three, you got the hockey mask. But Correct. um, like the thing is, like it sticks up here. Like mm -hmm. there are there are other things that are probably um, you know, beneficial to living life. That you normally store in your head. Yeah. No, no. Uh, you, I have, you have this. You this, have these. Yeah. This this knowledge of this '80s trivia stuck in my head all the yeah, time. Yeah, true. No, it's fine. Hey, listen. Whatever. Hey, it's paying off right now, man. That's yeah, good. All right. I'm gonna get that picture of Alf. You, you, you might. You might. <laughs> okay. In the original film series, who is Jason's yeah. first kill with his trademark machete? Is it A. Mark from Part Two? Is it B. Scott from Part Two? Is it C. Andy from Part Three? Or Allie from Part Three? Oh shoot. Mark, Scott, Andy, or Ali, first killed with his trademark machete. Machete. <clears throat> Say them again, please. Is it a Mark? Yeah. Do you want to know what? From, from what movie? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it Mark from part two? Okay. Is it Scott from part two? Okay. Is it Andy or Ali from part three? I'm going to say it's Mark from part two. Um, 
I'm going to say Mark from part two. Mark from part two. Well, I'm going to tell you, it's actually Scott from part two. Really? All of them were machete. All of them were machete. Um, uh, That I can't tell you, but Scott was the first one. He was caught in one of Jason's traps, remember? So Terry leaves to get a knife to cut a rope. And while while she's gone, he slits his throat. Right movie, wrong, wrong, wrong. uh, Okay. Not, Sorry. Not a, not a all big right, I got deal. one wrong. It's That's all fine. right. All right. At least I got I stumped you a little bit. I'm yeah. glad. I'm happy. All right. Here we go. Number six. In the original film series, who is Jason's first kill wearing his trademark hockey mask? Huh. Okay. Now these I don't have the actual um uh the 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 parts what not where they're from. But is it A. Edna, B. Shelley, C. Vera, Shelley. or D. Shelley. Harold? Shelley. Mm, okay. Your final answer. <laughs> I'm going to say no, um, but I'm going to go with it because I believe it was. But uh, It was Vera. Oh, Vera, really? When we first see Jason in the scene on Friday the 13th Part 3, oh, I Vera guess, mistakes yeah. him for Shelly. Okay, because he gets yeah. the hockey mask from Shelly, but he probably right, right, didn't right. have the hockey mask on yet. Okay, so, cool. They're stupid me. Oh, hey, hey, listen, we're all learning tonight, aren't Yeah, we? she thought it was Shelly. Hey, Shelly, what are you doing? You know. And, yeah, right, right. So. Okay, here we go. Ready? Dumb. Yeah, keep going. No problem, no problem. Um... <laughs> I'm just glad you're not breezing through these now. I know, I know. That's you got it's, some it's, confidence going me. in, and I'm right. not. I'm not big on the character names. Yeah, yeah. I mean, aside yeah. from like Tommy Jarvis and and. Uh... Well, you know what? You figure multiple choice. You got, you know, you got a little yeah. bit of a chance, right? Yeah. All right, number seven. And Jason goes to hell. The final Friday. Who was the first person to be possessed by Jason? Is it A. Josh, B. Randy, C. Robert Campbell, or D. The Coroner? The Coroner. You got he, it, bud. It's the yes, coroner. Yes, indeed. He the eats coroner. His heart. All these men are possessed by Jason, but the coroner is the first. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. All right. Yeah. So. <clears throat> good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. All right. Next, going next, on. Please. Numero eight. Loving in it. Which film series? Yep. I'm sorry. In in which film in the original series does Jason do the first infamous sleeping bag kill? Oh. Is it? <laughs> A, yeah. Friday the 13th Part 7. Is it B, yeah. Jason X? Is it C, Freddy versus Jason? Or is it D, Part 6? Okay, it's Part 7. It is Part <laughs> 7. That is yeah. right. One of my yeah. absolute favorite kills. Oh, my it's God, it was Judy. great. Yeah. It's and then Judy. He, but, but he did it, yeah. He did it against a tree, and then in Jason X, he actually had the he one where he like, wha- was whacking the other one. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> he had the sleep bag, and he was whacking the other person with that one. <laughs> it, dude, fantastic! I like I, those are my favorite favorite kills. Oh, the sleeping bag great. ones. Are, it's just so good. Like that's it, the thing is, like they're always about like, especially the newer ones are always about like, oh, it's it's about his machete, it's about his machete. But in the original ones, he really he did, used yeah. anything. Yeah, he did anything. Axes, anyway. machetes, harpoons, like all kinds of stuff. Yeah, it wasn't it wasn't just machete until like you know uh, I guess I don't know ten. You know, and then Freddy versus Jason, yeah, they yeah, put him yeah. in there with the machete, and yeah. uh, I don't know. It was All weird. right. We only got two more in this section. All right. Okay. Bring Number nine. That was eight, right? Nine. <clears throat> yes. Um, nine. Why does Mrs. Voorhees kill the camp counselors in Friday the 13th, the original? Do you want me to. Oh, sorry. A, no, no, no. I, I mean, I, I'll tell you. Sorry, I was actually listening. Because I heard, they weren't paying I heard, no, attention no, to, no, no. to Jason. They no, were no. responsible for his let death. Me, no, oh, let, me, let me give okay, you the go, things. Go. Is it A, she A, mentally unstable. B, the counselors did yeah. not watch Jason while he drowned. C, she did not like her job there. Or D, she was possessed by Jason. Two. B, B. the counselors B. didn't watch Jason while he drowned. That is correct, yes. Yeah. Sorry. I, I, those I, counselors, it was other counselors. Yeah. I um uh, I didn't she, give you uh, the, but yeah she's also mentally unstable I'm gonna I'm gonna well, go ahead say a both a and b a and b right yeah uh <laughs> yeah no I, I I heard I heard a click and I thought your audio went off so oh, oh. Yeah, audio's fine I thought I thought I couldn't hear you and I was like can you ah, hear me? we're good internet's okay last one in Friday the Thirteenth section who <laughs> reopened Camp Crystal Lake in Friday the Thirteenth was it a Alice was it b Steve Christie was it c Bill or d Marcy I say Bill man. You're going to say Bill. See Bill, he says, everyone. The correct answer is Steve Christie. <laughs> 1979, Steve Christie reopened the camp after the two man, murders. Man, those place. are the details that just don't, don't stick around, man. Yeah. All these little um, the, the characters and stuff. Anyway. All right. All right. So I didn't finish strong on Friday the 13th. But How you did. did you got, get? You How got many s- did I get? You got seven out of ten. Okay. Only that's three rolls. That that's, that's not it. bad. That's not bad. Come okay. on. That's not bad. All right. <clears throat> Moving on. Kenny, no, oh, I'm afraid. Oh, God, man, you're going to cruise through this, too. We're going to the Goonies. Ah, uh, bring it. Come All on. All right. Okay, here we go. Uh, number one. Yep. 
This is a tough one. I might not even have to tell you multiple choice. Like, let me just see if I can get it without it. All right. Well, I'm just going to read. Oh, you, okay. you, all right. All right. We'll try. And if I need it, I need it. Okay. Here that? we go. All right. It, what town is Mikey's house in? Astoria, Oregon. That's it. Yep. Good job. All right. Number two. What other popular movie was the actress who played Mama Fratelli in? Do I have it? We have it. You want it. It's Throw Mama from the Train. <laughs> it is Throw Mama from the from the proverbial Danny, train. It with is Danny DeVito. Yeah. Uh, Anne Ramsey is her name. Yep, absolutely. Yep, yep. Fantastic. Yeah. yeah. Um, all right, here's another really, really hard one. What year was Goonies released? 85. Yeah, well, you're right. <laughs> Good job. Good job, man. Good job. All right. Um, all right. How about this one, my friend? Yes, sir. Number four. What is the license plate number on the Fratelli's vehicle? <laughs> give me, me the give multiple me, choice. Let me give you multiple choice. Is okay. it TTH892? Okay. I'm not going to give the letters. I'm not going to say A, B, D, because it's going to ruin you. Mexico, Mexico, yeah. probably. Uh, TFH962. FSH987. Or FRA-996. I can give you a hint on this if you want. Let's go with D. Give me a hint. I'm the hint with... is um, Chunk opens, he sees it when he opens the garage door and sees the RV full of bullet holes. Yeah. Now picture yeah. that. Picture, picture I know. That. I can picture it. I'm going to go with D. Just D. FRA-996? Sure. Nope. No, it's, it's not because that's for that's for telly. No, right, it's not. Yeah, it's TFH-962 is what okay. it was. Yeah. Okay, cool. All right. RV bullet holes. Yeah, no, I'm, I don't know. <laughs> that's that's crazy. That's that's crazy detail or okay. All right. Well, you got let's me. see. You got me. I got you on that one. Okay. Let's try this one. One of these categories I have to get ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. That's well, my goal I'm gonna, at this point. I'm this gonna one, tell you this much. I can't believe it. My two strongest I've already ruined. Well, listen, listen, you might be able to get ten out of this because there's about twenty of these from the Goonies. So, oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Goonies, All right. I pulled a lot of questions for the Goonies. So. <clears throat> okay. All right, oh. number five. How many lawn mowing jobs did it take Brand to pay for his bike? A four hundred and twenty one. B, 200, C, 348, or D, 376? 348. 348, he says, folks, and the answer is close. It was 376, 376? yes. <laughs> close, 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 close. You're nuts, dude. Yeah, I know. Nuts. All right, how about this Killing one? Yeah. Number six. Hey, man, listen, you got to get, listen, you know I, I, it hey, so I'm, I'm well. I'm loving it. I'm loving I gotta it. got to give you it, right? We're fine. Uh, all right. Um, you know what I'm loving, Kenny, is that we haven't dropped any frames during this stream. So there you go. Okay. Number six, how does um, how does data travel to Mikey's house? Zipline. So is it A, he flies over, does he jump over, he rides his bike, or he uses his slick shoes? You said he what? Zip, zip line. What, what did you say? Fly over? Flies over, jumps over, rides his bike. Right. No, you got it. It's He flies yeah. over. It's a zip yeah. line. Why right? does it flies over? Zip line. Flies over. Um, bonus, uh, do you know... Um, what song he's playing as he does it? It's uh, James Bond, I believe. I'm giving you an extra point for that, buddy. Oh, you thank just you, got a, you just got an extra, an extra point. All right. Yep. Excuse me, everyone. Okay, number seven. Mm -hmm. What is the name of the wishing well that they're in? Is it A, Moss Garden, B, Green Garden, C, Willie's Well, or D, Inferno? Uh... What were the first two? Moss Garden, Green Garden, Willie's Well, or Inferno. What was the name of it? What like at the What top was the name of the, the wishing well? Yeah. What was the name of the wishing well? It out like because it was it, yeah it, it it was it was the it was the, the name na at the the top. Sure. Yeah. Or the name at the bottom. No, no, no. At the top, it was to to uh, Green Green Garden. Close. Moss Garden. Moss Garden. <laughs> these all these fifty percent chance, man. You I know. know. It's like I know. Uh, uh, you didn't whatever. go for Willie's Well, man. <laughs> it's definitely not Willie's <laughs> Well. All right, here's one. Here's one. What does Brand claim his mom is out buying for them? Diapers. So, yeah, I'm gonna give it to you. It's Pampers. Yep. He was. Okay. I was gonna give you the hint. He was talking to Choi's father. Yeah. And uh, he says, is your, he yeah. says, is your mommy here? He says, no, actually. No, sir. Actually, she's down at the market buying Pampers for all us kids. That's right. Fact. Fantastic. Fantastic. Number nine. Nine. Let's see how close you paid attention back in the day. All right. Let's just see how close you paid. Whoops. Uh, yep. Messed up the screen again. My bad. My bad. Uh, what is the name on the singer of Mouth Shirt? On Mouth Shirt. 
Mouth's shirt. What is the name I of the single on Mouth's shirt? Prince. Oh my God, I can't get that out. Yeah, Prince. you got it, Prince. It's Prince. Rain. No, it's Prince. Yeah. <laughs> Good stuff. I was going to say Cindy Lauper, Madonna, Prince, and Michael Jackson. You got it. Yeah. Although, why wouldn't it be Cindy Lauper considering she did the theme song? I don't know. They probably shot the movie and then they were like, hey, who can do the music? And right. Was yeah, probably. Yeah. Good enough for me is good. All right. <laughs> What is Mrs. Walsh's first name? Is it A, Irene, B, Maureen, C, Isabel, or D, Linda? I got this one wrong <laughs> when I first, when I was going through these. I didn't know she had one. I knew she's Mrs. Walsh. I don't know if they ever said her first name in the movie. Uh, maybe in the credits. I feel like it's probably going to be Irene or Doreen. Um so but Irina, I feel like Irina she looks Irina Maureen. Irina Maureen, whatever. Okay. I feel like she looks like a Linda, so I'm saying Linda. Ah, uh, see, that's what I said. I said Linda too, but it's Irene. Yeah, I figured yeah. it's, yeah. it's got to be one of those. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, hey man, we were both wrong on that one. Whatever. Um, all right, you got yard number eleven. What is the name of the restaurant the Fratellis hide out in? Is it A Fish Club? Is nope. it B Lighthouse Lounge? Mm -hmm. Is it C Sea View B. Place or is it Cliff House Inn? B. B, Lighthouse Lounge. That's mm -hmm. your final answer? 100%. Yeah, you're right. Correct. You're at 15. You got 15 right. That doesn't what? count the 15 points. I have to, The points are going to be like... Oh, wait. So I, that, are we done with the Goonies section? Not yet. Oh, okay. I'm just giving you an update. Okay. Um. Yeah, these these are all going to be like one and a half points each, I guess. That's fine. It's fine. Yeah, Whatever. I'll figure it keep out. It, keep it going. We'll figure it out. Uh, number 12. <clears throat> Which actor... Does Mouth say is on one of the coins in the well? Is it A, Martin Sheen? Martin is, Sheen, yes. It, he says Martin Sheen. You're right. It is Martin Sheen, which is hilarious. <laughs> Stupid. Instead of President Kennedy. Fantastic. Fantastic. All right, here we go. Number 13. Oh, this is this. Is, oh, this is, is a good one? It's a good one. <laughs> What are the notes that Andy 25% can't... chance. Uh, all right, yeah. What are the notes that Andy can't play? I'm sorry, that Andy can't decide between when playing the bones. Remember that scene? Is yes, it, yes. Yeah, I keep, is yeah. it G sharp and F flat? Uh-huh. Is it D sharp and E flat? Uh-huh. A sharp and B flat or B sharp and C flat? C, A sharp and B flat. You, you you got it. <laughs> you got it. It's A B. You got it, man. That's it. Good stuff. Good stuff. Because if you don't get it, we'll all be flat. That's right. That's right. No pressure, right, Andy? No pressure. All right. Number 14. Who wrote the screenplay for the Goonies? Was it James Cameron? <clears throat> nope. Robert Zemeckis? Chris, Chris Columbus? Chris Columbus or George Lucas? Chris Columbus. Chris Columbus. Yeah, you got it, man. You got it. But who directed the movie? Uh, Richard Donner. You did, yeah, you got it. Should I give him a bonus point for that? Mm -hmm. Heck yeah. yeah Fine. I'll give you a bonus point for that. <laughs> All right, you got a bonus point for that. Okay. Also okay, number 15. Uh, oh, we're down to the last two. Nice. Uh, Fine, I got to finish strong. All right, here we go. <clears throat> number 15. <clears throat> Who was the oldest Goonie during the filming of the movie? Was it Brand, Andy, Mouth, or Steph? Brand, Andy, Mouth, or Steph? I feel like you're tripping me up with this one because obviously it would be Brand. But I'm going to say you threw mouth in there, man. I know Corey Feldman always was a lot older than he looked. <laughs> and one of the girls, I know all the, all they were supposed to be all in the same grade. Right. Well, mouth was supposed to be younger, though. Mouth well, yeah, but the, but the, the girls and Brand were all the same. Right, yeah. Grade and right. then mouth was with Mikey Data and, and Chunk, right. but see so you kill me because I feel like it could go anyway. I feel like you might be tripping me up, being like, "Oh, it's not Brand; it's got to be somebody else." But I feel like what it should you, be what him. Did you, what did your gut say, man? My gut says Brand, okay. but I have a feeling it's probably going to be Steph or um or Martha Plimpton or Corey Feldman. Um, what do you got? Give me an answer. I don't. I feel like you, you threw Corey Feldman in there, and I feel like it's extremely 
feasible that it's Corey Feldman. But I'm trying to think. He was around the same age as as Corey Haim. And I don't feel that they were that much. I don't feel like at the time either of them were older than um, Josh Brolin. Mm-hmm. You go with Josh Brolin, Brand. He's going with Brand. The answer is actually Andy. Really? Kerry Green was 18 and Josh Brolin wow. was 17. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I knew that. I didn't. I didn't even. Fa- I didn't even think about her because I just. I thought she was young. She I would was, thought she was she, definitely younger. Nope. Than Josh. She was Brolin. the oldest out of all of them, and yeah. um, you know, Feldman. He was younger than them. Yeah, he, yeah, he yeah. That's what close. I'm saying. I, yeah. I just know it was kind of like not exactly a Webster situation, but right, right. All right. He always looks so much younger than than he. All than right. He, hey, man. No big deal. All right. Last one. Yeah. This is a tough one. What is one of Sloth's unusual talents? Is it eating ice cream? Is it moving his eyes all over? Is it singing lullabies or is it wiggling his ears? Let me go with. I was gonna say his eyes did do some kind of weird stuff. Yeah. But it's definitely wiggling his ears. Where the oh, it is it's, wiggling it's like his movement. ears. You are correct. And right, what's going on? Strong. What's going on? Hate white crackers. Well, you can't can't love them all, I guess. What's going on? Welcome. How you doing? Hey. Uh, by the way, we are streaming this live. We always forget to mention that up top. So hey. if you're listening or watching on the tube. Yeah. All right. That was it, man. That was um. 80, 80s trivia. Yeah. Play along. That was Goonies. You got um. What'd you get? Ten on that one, I guess. What'd you get? You got ten on uh, the other one. I didn't get ten. No, I got seven. Get 10. Out oh, you got of seven, and then now you're at twenty. So you got thirteen yeah. out of uh. There were what did I say? But you said 16. I got fifteen. No, that was before, dude. You just got five more. You're at, you're, you got 20 right so far. Oh, not just... Oh, God, I got you. Keep you going. got... You got... I got you. Yeah. Next. You're good. Next. All right, you're good. All right, we're going to Transformers. Do it. We're in Transformers. Now, I try to get some... Try to... Let's see. <clears throat> I want to see if I can if I can trip you up here. <laughs> trip me up, yeah. Let's try me. All right. All right. Now, number one. Uh, yeah. Which... Um, he's saying I'm here myself now on the thing. Anyway, which Transformer was not seen in season one of the Transformers? Was it A, Bombshell, B, Grimlock, C, Astro Train, or D, Skywarp? <clears throat> Who in was not one. seen in season one? Bombshell, Grimlock, <laughs> Astro Train, or Skywarp? Skywarp definitely was. Astro Train, Triple Changer came out probably not right away. I feel like Dinobots were in season one, or maybe they were in season two. Um, who was the first one? Bombshell. Bombshell, Insecticons. I feel like the Insecticons were definitely in season one. Okay. Um, it's going to be between Grimlock and Astro Train. Mm-hmm. Astro Train was definitely in the movie. He had a big part in the movie. This Grimlock is true. was also in the movie, but Grimlock was also. Gosh! Oh, First one, I got one of, him. It's one of the two of them, man. All right, it's make, one pick of one. the two of them, just, and I want to say, with go with it. Huh? Say it. Say it. Go. Astro Train. You got it. Astro Train didn't show up until season two. Good. You got it. Good job, man. All right, number two. How about this one? This is a good one. Who was the first Transformer scene in the G1 animated series? Who was the first one we see? Bumblebee's an answer. I'm choosing him. Ready? It's Wheeljack, Megatron, yeah. Optimus Prime, or Thundercracker. <laughs> it wasn't. <laughs> the first one? Yeah. Say it again. The first one to be seen in the G1 animated series. Okay. Is it Wheeljack, Megatron, Optimus Prime, or Thundercracker? Megatron. No. Nope. Wheeljack. Really? He's in his Cybertronian car mode. It's in Cybertron. I thought I thought Bumblebee was up there, and then I was thinking mm-hmm. Thundercracker might have been one of those little. Right, right. Extra- no, it was Wheeljack. He was the, he was remember he was like their mad scientist. Like, yeah, you I know. know. Yeah. All right, number three. Who provided the voice of Starscream in the G1 animated series? Chris Lotta. You got it. Yep. That is it. Yep. Also, Cobra Commander. He was also Cobra Commander. That's right. Uh, yeah. I was gonna try and trip you up, and give you, you know Cullen Welker, and then no. K- you know give you give you a little Casey Kasem in there too. Yeah, no, no, no. Um, okay, <clears throat> who is 
considered the Decepticon guardian of Cybertron? Shockwave. Oh, out the gate. Just yeah, you're right, man. You got it. It's definitely shot. Run it out there. That's all that's all he did was hang around that. That's bridge, all he did, right? right? And he just got, that's he all got he did. The, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Okay. Very good. Such a cool looking character, and all he did was hang around. Yeah. I yeah. know, right? Oh man. And and one of the coolest um uh toys too. Yes. I like yeah. him. Yep. Above my head over there. Hey, sir. Um, okay. Of the following Transformers. Mm-hmm. Which one is not a Decepticon Seeker jet? Is it Skywarp, Jetfire, Thrust, jetfire. or jetfire. Dirge? Jetfire, you're saying? Okay, you got it. Yeah, it is Jetfire. Yep, or Skyfire. If you skyfire watch. on the TV show, right? Jetfire yeah. and the the toy Skyfire on the show. Uh, well, he's Jetfire because he now he, he was Skyfire, right? And then he's Jetfire because he's with the Autobots or something. Mm -hmm. No, the it was. Uh... It was an issue with uh, the lights, the rights of um, like the Macross. Oh, that's thing. right. That's the toy right. was Macross, and it was. Oh, because that was one of the first ones they made. <clears throat> yeah, they couldn't. They that's couldn't right, put yeah. the toy version of him in the show. Right. Because of um, there was also, um, you know what I'm saying? Ro yeah. Robotech was it? Yeah. I think it was Robotech. Mm -hmm. Because it was a cartoon Robotech, and it was already claimed by that, so they had to change the character for the the show. Yeah. Right. 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 Um, he was actually the, um, he's one of the only audio Autobots that was capable of sustained flight in season one. Little, uh, tidbit. That what? In season one? So he was the only one that, uh, could oh, have yeah, sustained fly? flight. Yeah. Yeah. The first episode, I think they all flew like Optimus Prime and everything yeah. just it was weird, but yeah, that was it. They never did it again. All right. Here's a, here's a hard one. Uh, it's a yes or no answer. Does Unicron make his first appearance during the G1 television series? Yes or no? No. That's right. That is correct, sir. Yep. Sir, you are correct. It was an animated you. movie that That's he was correct. in. Uh, who is, number seven, who is the first combiner we see in the G1 animated series? Is it Defensor, Superion, Devastator, or Bruticus? Devastator. It is Devastator, correct, yes. Yep. They are the Constructicons. Facts. Uh, okay, number eight. Yep. Of, of the following Transformers... Which one is not one of Soundwave's cassettes? Frenzy, Kickback, Rumble, Kickback. or Ratbat? Kickback. Kickback. Kickback, yeah. Kickback you, is the uh, Insecticon. You are absolutely correct. Absolutely. He was the grasshopper, right? Fact, yep. Yep. Uh, all right, cool. Number nine. Let me just see where, where are we. Oh, no, we got a little more than, okay. A few more. Number nine. Mm-hmm. Oh, phew. Why did I leave this one in here? Well, this is a free before you. Which Autobot had an alternate mode as a boombox cassette player? Blaster. Yeah. <laughs> Dang it. You're I a funny character. I didn't mean to leave that one in there. Uh, Blaster loves music. What can you do? Can All you do? right. Oh, God. Another easy one. What Decepticon? Which Decepticon produces Energon cubes from his chest? It's Soundwave. It is Soundwave, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Hey, you chose these, man. You know. It's all good. Uh oh! I think we got. Let me see. We got a couple. It's more. making me look good. You know what I mean? It's making you look like good. It's making your eighties. You tell it's your eightying. I eighties. I eighties. Definitely your eightying right now. So that's yep. good. Um, let me look. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that was that one. Number eleven. Mirage has the ability to do what? Uh, become invisible, teleport, yeah. project holograms, hey. or creates clone. A. Hey. Become invisible. Yep. Yes, you're correct. <clears throat> good job. He sure does. Thank you. Good job, bud. All right, last one for this. One what? of these things is not like the other. Okay. Blitzwing, Astro Chain, Beachcomber, and Springer. Okay. Um, first of all, it's Beachcomber. Second of all, did you say Astro Chain? I said Beachcomber. Astro Chain, yeah. Oh, I thought you said Astro Chain, not Astro Train. No, it's Astro Beachcomber. Train. The rest are triple changers. Correct. You got it, man. Absolutely. Good job. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well done, oh, Misa on, Donwell. Thank you very much. All right, you know where we're going? Super Mario Brothers? No, Karate, Karate Kid. Kid. <laughs> time for you to uh, time for you to wax on and wax off. I, I don't even know I'm where ready. they are. Let's They're go. not even up behind you. I know. We're I was just watching Cobra Kai again last night. So oh let's my! Go. Did, wait, did you finish season two? I never finished season two. I just got to. I just watched four and five last night. Of season two. I gotta. I gotta finish that, and then I'm gonna start on uh, probably Better Call Saul. Not start on it, but finish up. I think I was in season three. Okay. And I kind of trailed off, so I'm going to continue yeah, to I watch that. I couldn't get through season one to be a better car soul, but oh, just skip season Cobra one. Kai is so good. <laughs> yeah. So good.
All right, here we go. Number one. We're in the Karate Kid. Okay, let's go. Number one, who is the first friend Daniel makes after he moves in? Is it A, Allie, B, Mr. Miyagi, yeah. C, Mr. Johnny, Miyagi. or D, Freddy? Uh, Mr. Miyagi. Actually, it was Freddy. What? Daniel kicks open the gate, and he hits him in the face with the gate, remember? And then he and then late, he, and then his, he, invites he wasn't really him. his friend, was he? Well, he invites him to the beach party. It was like the first kid that he made. It was the first right, person perfect, that man. he met. Yeah. All right, you got me, man. I got you on that one, man. Uh, how about this one? Number two, why does Mr. Miyagi first go to Daniel's apartment? A, to fix a sink. B, to fix Daniel's bike. D, to fix a shower. or uh, C, to fix a shower. Or D, to give Daniel karate lessons. The sink. Yes, it is the sink. Correct. You got it. The sink shooting water in the air, remember? Yeah, yeah. And he's like, hey, can you fix my sink? Okay. Like the Goonies. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> All right, number three. According to Cobra Kai, yeah. what three things do not exist in their dojo? Anger, fear, and defeat. Pain, anger, and fear. Pain, fear, and defeat. Or hate, pain, and fear. Pain, fear, and defeat. Pain does not exist in this dojo, does it? And you no say, sensei. No sensei. Fear does not exist in this dojo, does it? No sensei. Defeat does not exist in this dojo, does it? No sensei. Well done, man. Did I mark that? What? I think I did. I just marked it, didn't I? No, I didn't. I'm marking that for you. I don't think you did. I just marked it now. Good job. <clears throat> well done, man. But my performance was worth an extra point, so. Well, you missed the first one. You didn't cat. You should have caught it right away. I can't give that to you. Can't what? Give it to you. You, you missed the first one. I, I did the, the question. First one. What? The no. first question? No, you said your performance. I, you said it, it provided another, it gave you another point, but the first one oh. was a little lacking. Uh, let's go it. to number four. Number four. It was, I agree. All right, I number agree. four. What birthday does Daniel celebrate during this movie? Is 17th, 15th, 16th, or 18th? 15th. 17th, 15th, 16th, or 18th, and you say 15th? Yeah. It's his 16th. Really? Yeah. Oh, because he can drive now. Yep. And gotcha. um, how about this? You want a bonus point? What does yeah. Mr. Miyagi do for his birthday? Can you name any three? He gives, gives him a car. Okay. Can you name any others? He, get, he gets a, a cake. Yep. And there's one more. I got You get the bonus point. But is there, can you think of the last thing he does for him? That Mr. Miyagi does for him. Yeah. Gives him the bandana? No. One more. That was at the end of the movie. Remember, he walks in. Oh, that was the belt. Happy birthday. He sings to him? Yeah. But he, he bakes him a cake. He baked him a cake. You got a bonus point, though. <laughs> he bakes him a cake. Remember, he walks in and he's got the cake? Yeah, but I already answered that. What was the other thing? No, no. You didn't say cake. He gave him a patch. Said... You said the patch in his car. You said I didn't cake. say patch. Oh, he said cake? I said cake. Oh, I thought you said patch. Yeah, no, patch. 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 No, I wouldn't have gotten patch. Okay, all right. Anyway, whatever. Moving on. Yeah. Uh, okay, uh, number five. When Ali asks Daniel for his name, what does he say? Does he say Daniel LaRusso? Does he say Daniel with a D? Does he say Daniel with an L? Or does he say whatever you want it to be? <laughs> Daniel with a D. He says Daniel with a... She said Ali with an I. Or Ali with a Y. Ali with an I. Daniel said, with a D. He says Daniel with an L. He says Daniel with an L? Oh, because yeah, at the end of... Yeah. Yep. I'm ah. an idiot, man. Yep. I'm not, I'm not thinking. I'm answering too quickly. I know. You got to come on. Get your head back in the game, man. All right. All right. Here oh. we go. Well, at least I'm stumping you on some of these, man. It's because it's stupidity is what it is. <laughs> hey, whatever They're good it is, questions. It is. You're, you're, you're... All right. Good, I got to use a part of my brain that I guess I normally don't, don't use. Right, right. All right. Here we go. Number six. When on their date, why don't Allie and Daniel go down the water slide? Is it A, too cold? B, Allie doesn't want to get wet? C, Johnny is there? Or D, they don't have bathing suits? Too cold? Allie don't want to get wet? Johnny's there? Or they don't have bathing suits? They don't have bathing suits. You got it. <laughs> Bonus point... What's the name of the place that they're at? Is there a multiple choice? Nope. Nope, then I don't know. 
Ah, all right. Do you want me to tell you? The, the moss wishing well. <laughs> it's golfing stuff. What is it? Golfing stuff? Golfing stuff. Remember that? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, she says we need bathing suits. And he goes, oh, yeah, bathing suits. Uh, here's a fun one. Remember Franken seven, stuff. To... Remember the hot dogs? Franken stuff? Oh, yeah. Franken stuff. Yeah. <laughs> cheese right. inside chili inside oh my god i love the chill dude the chili ones <laughs> i'm still looking for those dude i'm still looking for those man i thought those were from oscar Mayer, though weren't they i don't i think they were hormel um I either miss... it was hormel chili inside of them or talk about like, 80s like, man i'm gonna get a hormel, drink but yeah talk about the 80s man stuff, dude man. <laughs> it was oh, like i, I, I remember there it. being years afterwards it was just I, i'm just eating a hot dog with nothing in it yeah you know what i mean like yep. where's the stuff inside i'm gonna be gross for a second yeah. And the taste of the ones with the chili inside, you can get that taste at 7-Eleven. Their chili tastes just like that chili. Oh, really? <laughs> it's so it's so bad, dude, but I... All right, mm. All right number seven. Yeah. At the tournament, who injures Daniel's leg and almost causes him to... Withdraw? Knew you were going to ask me something stupid about these these these, these names. Is it right? A, Johnny, B, Bobby, C, Dutch, or D, Miguel? It's... it's, it's... The second one, B. Bobby? Yeah. That is correct. That is correct. He <laughs> says, remember? He says, uh, he orders him to hurt him. He says, sweep the leg, right? And it he would. says, but, I, but Sensei, I can beat this guy. I don't want to beat him. I want him disqualified. And he's like, I'll be disqualified. And he's like, out of commission. So, yeah. All right, good stuff. All right, here's a good one for you. Number eight, Kenneth. At sure. the Halloween dance, Daniel yeah. gets hit in the head with an egg. All right. Is your mind yeah. there? Yeah. What costume is the guy who threw it wearing? A chicken. Whoa. He's got it. <laughs> got it in one. It is a chicken. You want a bonus point? Yeah, sure. Where are Daniel and Allie when that happens? Him. They're on the dance floor. It's a, it has to do with his costume. They're inside the shower. Yeah, should I give you a bonus point for that? I don't know. I don't. I'm like, I didn't know what you meant. Where are they? Like, he's always I, I in didn't the want shower it because it's so him. easy. Because it's right. Yeah. All right. Never mind. Let's keep moving. <laughs> okay. Number nine. Daniel tells Allie and her friend that he got a scrape on his head from falling off his bike. What mm -hmm. kind of bike does he say he has? Is it a a Yamaha X70, a Suzuki Turbo, a Miyagi Turbo, or a Honda Z180? Suzuki Turbo. Ah, uh, no, it's a Miyagi Turbo, he says. Really? Yeah, Miyagi Turbo. I thought that one you just threw in there because you couldn't think of anything better. No, he says Miyagi All right, Turbo. got yeah. me. Good one. Got right. me. Good one. All yeah. right. All right, last one. Last one. All right. What don't Allie and Daniel do at golf and stuff? Is it A, play ski ball, B, take pictures, C, jump on a trampoline, or D, ride go-karts? <laughs> You're killing me. I know. I know for a fact they took pictures. It was a montage, right? Think of the montage. Do they They took pictures. I'm gonna say I can picture them on go-karts. Okay. Um You're the other there. ones were play were... ski ball or jump on a trampoline. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. I'm gonna say they probably had ski ball there, but jumping on a trampoline is just sounds preposterous. So I'm going with that one. Ah, uh, no, it was they didn't play skee ball. Really? They were never shown playing skee ball. Okay. Yeah. All right. Not bad. Not bad. I don't remember how many you got out of that. I'm not paying attention stink. to that. But I stink. Um, all right. We got eight more left, Kenny. We got eight more left. All right. Did you have to reset that camera or something real quick? I don't already done. Did it? Good job. All right. We're in Mario Brothers, man. Super Mario Brothers. Let's do it. All right. So this is going to be for the game. Just the first one the or first the game. series? I or... believe. I be, let me just double check. I think it's because all going to be I, from... when I told you like Friday the 13th, I was, you know. No, I know the, that. The this, whole series. But this I chose because I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell you what. A Karate Kid, actually, yeah. You didn't even ask anything with the other movies. Just no, the no, first no, no, one. no. I only went with the first one because it's a lot of stuff. And I just yeah, wanted yeah. you I wanted you to be focused. So this is only going to be from the first game, okay? Wow. So We're Friday the 13th I... got a. Um... That one, yeah, that one, I that, that one, all I, over. yeah, because you oh. knew all, you knew so much about that, dude. I know you know. Plus, I wanted to, I wanted to showcase your your vast knowledge of all oh. the, all the movies. So thank you very much. You're welcome. Appreciate that. All right, here we go. Number one in in Mario Brothers. Yep. Um, Princess Peach had a different name in this game. Toadstool, Princess Toadstool. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> well done, well done, well done. 
Um, can you? Uh, oh, never mind. The little little tidbit: when they gave her the name Peach, Toad still became her last name, but she was still a princess at the time. Mm-hmm. Uh, number two, mm. Mushroom Retainer is the name of what character from that game? Mushroom Retainer. I'm gonna say it's probably like Toad or whatever Toad is. Yep, you got it, man. It is Toad. Mm. He was at the end of every level that. Remember telling you, oh, yeah. he, thanks. He was like the strawberry shortcake. I, I know, yeah. Right? It's like ridiculous. Right? But yeah, the princess is in another character mm-hmm. or nothing. But he Castle. got his name Toad in, um, in Mario Brothers 2. Super Mario Brothers 2. Oh, okay. Um, okay, number four. Mm-hmm. Halfway there, man. Halfway to the end here. Uh, how many coins does it take to get a one-up? 100. 100. Yeah, you got it. Did you... A little trivia after that. Um... Every other like Mario game, it would just uh, change to fifty, I think. So. Really? Yeah. The thing is, I know you didn't play a whole heck of a lot of other ones past three or uh, four, actually, right? You didn't. You didn't play all those other ones like I, Mario sixty four and the, Sunshine. Well, I did play sixty four. Um, I beat sixty four. I know that. Right. I don't think I got all the stars. Yeah. Um, but I know I played Sunshine, and that's where it stopped for me. Yeah. Well, I yeah, I figured I never beat it. I just that's why I didn't want to. I didn't want to go anywhere with those. Um, yeah. All right, number five. How many worlds are there in Super Mario Brothers? Eight. That is correct. Or four, four, I guess, levels in each world, right? Yeah. Uh, well, that you got the answer to that one too. I was gonna say, how oh, many okay. levels are there in each world? I got you. I got you. So thirty-two. Yeah. No, you were right. It was it was four. There's four levels in each world. There's eight in worlds. In each world. Yeah. 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 Um, good job. You got two points on that. Uh, number seven in world one two. Yep. How can you warp to world two three or four? Uh, take the elevator up over top of the bricks, go over to the side, and warp zone will be there with the pipes. Ah, yeah, you got it. Yeah, you got it. You get to the top. Yeah. There was an elevator. Oh, yeah, there man, was an elevator that was on top. That's right. Up. Yep. Yeah. I forgot about the elevators. Yeah. Um, or, yeah, right. I mean elevators, right? Like this platform, moving platform. It was a moving platform. All right, so here's the last one. And th- with this, all right, so these Mario Brother questions were supposed to be like bonus ones. They okay. weren't. They weren't really supposed to be. That's why they're so they're so flipping easy, you know. So how do you beat? The, how do you defeat the boss of Mario, Super Mario Brothers? You can shoot him with fire, or jump on top over him on top of the axe, or go underneath yeah. him on top of the axe. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, you got it. Um, I remember years ago, I beat that game on one life. Right, my friend did it years ago. Obviously, but um, when we were kids, he beat it on one life one time because I was Luigi and I was waiting for him yeah. to stop playing. And that's where Super Mario Brothers three was so much better because it was like you alternated levels. Right. So somebody died, next person got to go, or if you finished a level, the next person got to go. Right, um, right. And I remember sitting there one time waiting because I'm he was always Mario and I was Luigi because it was at his house or whatever. And uh, he goes through and he beat the entire game on one life. And then I was like, I guess I'm not playing. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm less like. Well, now I got it. You know, now it's my turn because it started over or whatever like that, right? Because now instead of the Goombas, it had like the little hard shell dudes, the mm-hmm. Beatles or whatever like that. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, and he was, I don't remember if Luigi got to go after that or if he still was going. I don't recall. Yeah. But um, I remember that being a crazy thing. But I did it one time on my own at home and I played the whole entire game and I got up to um, Bowser in you know eight i used the warp zones it's not like i went through every single level but i used the warp the two warp yeah you because you can get you get to eight in like five minutes yeah yeah so i got to eight and I, I got through the whole entire thing and i was large when i got there and i was like all right instead of messing around i'm just gonna jump into them shrink right and then hit the axe and that's what i did so i finished the game you know because i was like i'm not gonna sit around and mess around because god forbid i get hit by one of his axes right then you know hit. like i'm yeah. gonna you know and then i could potentially die so i just literally just ran into him jumped on top of him just to shrink right and then i jumped on top of the uh, axe and i was like all right i'm good i beat super mario bros on one life a lot of people do that speed run stuff doesn't doesn't interest me i was interested in doing it on one life and that was it one life that was it yeah all right good stuff man um all right so let me tell you tally you up there's 57 total questions um yeah yeah man it it is what it is i'm just gonna i'm just gonna let's just let's just let's let's just see what you you got you've got uh let's see 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 Uh 44 i got 44 44 out of 57 let me see one point each double it i got an 88 
All right, there you go. You did it. You, you made it to 88. <laughs> you got in the 80s. You you 80s, bro. You see that? I 80s, bro. Good it's job, awesome. man. All right, dude. Yeah, you got it. Good time. That was that was a little trivia. That was trivia. good. I like that. I like the trivia, trivia stuff, man. I know I've been asking you some trivia things and doing that interactive stuff, yeah. and uh, it's kind of pretty neat. It's uh, it's a lot of fun. It's definitely fun. You know, yeah. we're, we're not in the same room, so it's hard for us to do things where we have to, like, interact and everything. Um, yeah, it's, it's fine. And throwing up images on the screen like we normally do, it's... It's a little tedious when we're in separate areas. So, but hey, that's that. Um, hey, that was fun. You did real yeah. good. I enjoyed it. Thank um, you. Um, that was good. Good job. Everyone can see that Ken eighties and oh, did I eighties last week? I did. You did. You oh, most the, certainly. Did. Well, the the last yeah. one of the other episodes I would um, say last week. Depending. On I don't remember what episodes. your score was. I have eighty five. Right I got like eighty five. Yeah, you had something like that. Yeah. I think I was like eighty five. Yeah. Yeah, I added everything up, and I know you. I know you 80s. Yeah, yeah we definitely, definitely 80s. We definitely oh, 80s. 85, yeah, yeah. Because I took 28 points off for ones that didn't count, yeah. and yeah, ended I, up getting uh, yeah. 80, 85. Yeah. All right. Very 85. cool. Very cool. All right. Well, that's gonna do it um, for us now. Uh, I don't want to date the show, but if you're, if you know, whoever, just hope everyone's being safe out there. Enjoy the 80s. Yeah. Um, just if you want, you can get to us on. Uh, uh, which I'm gonna call it. There it is. There's our stuff on the screen. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. You can get to us. We've got a group on Facebook. You can check it out. Go to this our page. page. Do you even '80s, bro? That's it. And um, Kenneth, uh, why don't you say uh, something '80s related? Um, '88, man. I got an '88. 88 miles per hour. There it is. That's what I was waiting I, for, man. That's what you. That's you, what you need. my friend, are going back. Hour. You're going back um, to the. Go, go back to 85 yeah well we were in listen we were ju we were just in the 80s and now it's time to go back to the future bro so with that hey, we'll see you guys uh next time although i'm not sure if i want to be in the future at this point mm, yeah maybe. i want to go back to the 80s Chris. let's go back let's stay there we're gonna stay there yeah. we're just gonna stay there all right see you later guys bye